Hi there, good day. Once again, this is Captain Bjorn Fernandez. And for the for today's vlog, I'm going to teach you on how to show your vetting inspectors or terminal inspectors, safety inspectors, third parties, even flags and class inspectors in showing your ECDIS chart 1. Okay? So gentlemen, let me show you. I am carrying Transas Wartzilla. And here's the model. Wartzilla Navisailor 4000. Okay? So we are required to show you this uh, ECDIS chart 1 during inspection. So let's bring it out. Okay? On how to show your ECDIS chart 1, you need first to go to your task list here on this uh, lower right button. Left click and then click on charts okay once you click on charts this will appear okay your complete list okay and there's the load chart button on the upper right and of course the general tab layers tab and then the ENC tab okay so first thing to do is to show the inspector that you have presentation library one okay how to do it? Just click here the information and click on any part of your ECDIS chart. Left click and then the chart data will appear here. Scroll down. Once you scroll down, just go to the general information. It says there presentation library edition 4.0 okay and uh, with this uh, general information you will see the producing agency code it's by UK and country code again and of course the compilation scales okay compilation scales issue date horizontal datum it's WGS 84 or the world geodetic system 1984 Vertical datum that is reference to the mean high water springs, okay, and also the sounding datum. It is reference on that uh, chart that you have clicked on that location. It is reference to the approximate lowest astronomical tide, and the depth unit. It is in meters. Height unit is also in meters. So with depth units, uh, we're pertaining on the underkill clearance and height units for the overhead clearance okay so that's number one showing your inspector the presentation library for okay close this one and uh, for the next one is to show your inspector the act this chart one charts okay so first go to layers okay or ENC tab and click plane and paper Okay, all right. With that, after that, unclick this highlighted buttons, the danger in shallow water, contour labels, four shades, full light lines, highlight info, highlight dot. Okay, so everything is unclick and is set on plain paper chart. Okay, now go to the chart number now here is the thing remember this gentlemen you have to write this down so we have uh, actually several charts but you're just supposed to show these two charts the alpha alpha 5 charlie 1 alpha bravo 1 and then the next one will be alpha alpha 5 charlie 1 alpha bravo 2 so load this alpha alpha 5 charlie 1 alpha bravo 1 just left click upper right button you click on load chart once you click your act this chart one appears okay and then after that you just need to browse so you can minimize and it will show you the uh, chart squares okay those several chart act this chart one okay there's a lot okay so that is what is the sets for your this chart one sets. All right. So how to prove first on the general information from the charts once again. Here, click charts. Okay. 
and then uh, info click info then click on any at this chart one and then you will see journal information presentation library for so it's small almost the same as what we have done on my on the first method that I've shown you but this is the uh, correct one of showing the inspector the first one was my shortcut method of showing at this or presentation library edition 4.0 okay now we may close this one and another method or the next method will be to load this number two chart at this chart one alpha alpha 5 charlie 1 alpha bravo 2 upper right corner load chart once you load chart lower down the your chart list and then you're supposed to see this uh, update review okay so it's not highlighted therefore we click enc tab and then click update review there you go okay and with the update review okay you should you should put uh, in between the in between the years 0 1 okay, 0 4 2014 so click 2014 there you go in between 0 1 0 4 2014 to 27 August 2014 so let's say uh, today is April 18 okay we can choose that as long as it's 2014 meaning it is covered all right and then after that you can see here the update okay the information about chart display if it's deleted it will show like this with a cross out if it's updated it will show with an encircled bolded orange circles all right so that is the alpha alpha 5 charlie 1 alpha bravo 2 okay that's how you do it and lastly for the date dependent object okay so we go back to the ENC settings. We unclick the update review. And we click the date dependent object. And also the highlight date dependent. So for this one, uh, we should also set from 01 April 2014 to 27 August 2014. Alright, so today is... Uh, 18 yeah there you go it's 1804-2014 meaning it is already set okay and then there you go you will be able to see the proper features as indicated on your at this chart one it says their display not real time because you are showing your at this chart one okay and these are the natural and non-made features port features also earlier information about chart display also information about chart display alpha bravo one okay over this one And we have the depth, currents, etc. The seabed obstructions, pipelines. Okay. That's how it looks like. Also the traffic routes. Okay. Special areas. The color test diagram. Top marks. Okay. Remember, this is 
This is set on plain and paper chart. The boys and beacons and aids and services. Okay. And of course, the approved new symbols for AIS and virtual AIS. Lateral marks, cardinal, and other marks. Okay. And of course, once you've shown him, the inspector, uh, you are supposed to return it to your original settings. Of course, and click it and change it back to symbolize areas, left click, and simplified points. Okay, click danger in shallow water, contour labels, four shades if your company prefers four, if two, then no need to click four shades, shallow pattern if you need. Uh, scale minimum if you are monitoring full light lines highlight info and highlight doc to show your uh, TNPs and AIO or Admiralty information overlays on your ECDIS charts and if you are planning you can click accuracy for the category of zone of confidence all right and of course with the layers uh, make sure it is set to all or if using standard or whatsoever and scale bar should be there over scale it will appear in the upper left corner nav text as well and then chart auto load and chart auto scale and then ENCs since we are using ENCs okay so that's how you do it and then you can just simply unload by closing this act this uh, chart list close and then automatically it returns back to your position and act this settings okay that is all thank you for watching again this is captain bjorn fernandez please like and subscribe and follow my channel at cma discarding bjorn 4780 bye